welcome back to another video. As you can see, we have the Harley on the motorcycle stand, and this is it. This is a video where we finally fix the Harley. If you didn't know, the Harley had major battery problems. Well, the batteries weren't the issue, eh, more or less. But the battery wasn't holding charge because the motorcycle wasn't charging the battery while we ride. In other words, the stator was messed up. Um, so, we got a new stator, we have some new fluids for it, oil change, all that stuff, some stuff for the derby cover, um, yeah. Oh, and we need to clean the carburetor. We also need to clean the carburetor. Um, so, this is coming off. The battery is most likely coming out. We gotta make sure that's still good. This is coming out. I believe all of this is coming out. I'm not 100% sure, um, but it's coming apart today. And it should start after that. But look at this, this thing looks nice here. Um, you, got, you got all the new LEDs up in the garage. The Harley looks good. <clears throat> Just took off the seat and the side bags. Probably gonna leave the side bags off for now. This, this looks really clean. This looks really clean. It also needs to get clean, but it looks really clean right now So got to do all that stuff today. That's what we're doing. The Harley's finally getting fixed <sighs> And then riding season will be starting soon. So If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this one or future videos like the motorcycle seasons or even the Impala because the Impala is back on the channel now. It's out of hibernation. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We are at 1.2 thousand subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> We're doing it. We're killing it. Um, honestly, I don't really know what too much else to say. Let's get on with the video. So, first things first on the list, we got a take out the oil Ooh, this is that's gonna be tough because this is right there so we gotta do oil change well take out the oil um, right here we got all the parts that we need uh, voltage regulator stator and then the rotor for the, for the stator itself and then a bunch of other stuff for the oil gaskets got another piece up there but yeah these are all the parts that we got for this um, this should be fairly I think. Uh, actually, I don't, I don't think it'll be fairly simple. But um, enough talking. Let's get to work. Cause don't know how long this is gonna take, and I kind of want. I want to. I want to ride it already. So uh, I'm gonna get to work. Well, I'm gonna get to work right now, and my dad's gonna get here, and then he's gonna help me. Yeah, working together. We're gonna get this done today, um, so we can hurry up and get riding. So let's go. So, currently, we got all this opened up, but we need to take this off to get to the stator back there and the rotor cover. So, we need to take this off, but when we spin this with this big ass wrench, the whole chain moves. So, we need to make a wedge or something to stop the chain from moving and making all this stop moving so we can actually apply enough force to loosen this big bolt. So yeah, that's where we're at right now. Um, what time is it? It's 12.44. Um, we have to, I'm actually going tuxedo shopping for prom at six. So I think we're, I think we're good on time. Uh, five hours, um, we should be good. Okay, well less than five hours, we gotta get ready. But anyway, I think we're good on time. Um, we're gonna try and get as much done as we can today. Um, 
But yeah, we'll see how this goes. So, this way is not working. Well, at least, because we need to apply enough force, but the whole bike is moving, so one person has to hold the bike, one person has to apply all the force. This this is really really tight. This is this is about this is most likely going to be the hardest thing we deal with today. So once we get this, it should be all uphill from here. Not like up uphill in a good way. You know you know what I mean. So yeah, um, <laughs> we're gonna keep going at it. Um, we're definitely gonna try and get this off. But I don't really know what myself to say. We <laughs> we really got a brute force to this thing. <sighs> so we managed to take everything off. The magnet was coming off. Well, it was all loose. It was stuck to the stator, which is all fucked up and fried. That's all messed up. So... Well, good thing we got both of them new. <laughs> the new ones are over here. Now we gotta just put them on. That's 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 real dirty and messed up.
it's trying to turn on. It's definitely trying to turn on. It wants to stay on. Damn. What happened? Huh? What happened? Awesome. Well, I know, but why did it start now? At least it's turning on there. Oh, yeah. It probably needs gas too. That is it for today's video. The Harley is fixed. It's on. Everything is good on it now. Like that. That. That's pretty much it. It's just like little maintenance stuff. Like we need new tires for it. But like mechanically wise, the Harley is pretty much complete. Um. Got. Um. Yeah. That thing is awesome. Um. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um. Right. It was a lot of time lapses fixing the Harley. But let me know what you guys think about those type of videos. Um, with that being said, don't forget to like and subscribe. We got lots of videos coming soon with the Impala, with um, the Ducati, the Harley, the Safari. We got lots of videos coming. So don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss a video. I would really appreciate it. And with that being said, I'll see you in the next one.